was forever I remember snuff video So we have arrived at Kingston Park joined by Johnny and we are in the press area today because we've got that connection with NUFC women so thankfully they've put us up and uh, we're going to give them loads of coverage on both channels today Cold September's the distances we covered the fist fights on the beach The busies round us up Do it all again next week In embryonic love The first time that it's sky Embarrass yourself for someone Crying like a child And the boy you kicked Tom's head in Still bugs me now That's the thing it lingers and cause you when you die Just take the lead for an absolute hell of a strike, top corner. Katie Barker's arguing with the referee saying handball, the decision wasn't given. But Ipswich have taken the lead very early on. Time Newcastle are one 0 down for a great strike, Johnny. Yeah, fantastic strike. Worst, worst possible start for Newcastle. Um, possible handball though, and it looks like it just brushed the arm of the Ipswich Town midfielder as it goes towards O'Brien, who puts in a fantastic uh, finish right in the top corner. No chance for uh, Grace Donnie in the goal for Newcastle, but. Since then, it's been a bit scrappy. I think Ipswich have had probably the better chances. Newcastle have had a header over the crossbar, but I think it's probably the perfect time for Newcastle to kind of read, uh, really just get back into action. A half time, Becky kind of gets more instructions out of the players because they need a goal, they need to do something in the second half.
official attendance yet it is 2756 what a turnout for the ladies brilliant So we've got an injury to an Ipswich player. Brooke has called for all the girls to come together. The pressure's there. We're going to go into the last 10. The focus, of course, is to put pressure on Ipswich's box. And you can hear the young, young fans singing Newcastle. 